Who's round the corner while I got this drop He told you he my friend but that bitch the op I'm up early like I slept with the alarm clock This gun hot like I tucked it in some long john Same clothes for three days, orange and blue shoelace Closet full of khakis, you can't tell me I ain't groovy man Alright, it's recording now. Yeah, we we on we on live. We on live, group line. I got the homie Big Ace Crown live from the pen. He got some Ace to Crown say. live from the pen. You know what I mean? Y'all hold it down. Big Ace Crown pushing Crown business. Y'all, you know, hold it down. Fight this motherfucking murder case in North Carolina. They can't hold a real nigga down though. I'll be about to hear song. Y'all the homies and homegirls out there doing their thing. Y'all hold it down. Y'all keep pushing. Y'all keep keep the groove and full trade to the one way 716. I know how we do it. Y'all know how we rock. Go this west side over all the way to the cast to drop. Yeah, yeah. Fucking right. Wen wen and all that. Wen no. Straight up, man. Right. That's we right. waiting on we wait we waiting on you to come home, hog. We are, by the time you come home, you know, once you jump on this platform, we we going dumb. <laughs> Yeah, that's a fact, bro. We're going harder. We're going down. We're going hard. We're going hard as a motherfucker. Yeah, man. We 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 working, baby. You know what I mean? We waiting on Minnie C to go on and kick the door in, door down on the HG. You know what I mean? On the HC level. Fucking yeah. right. Yeah. I'm coming. I'm drop kicking that bitch. Minnie C. Minnie C. She got the torch right now. That's like Crown, man. She got the torch, man. She gonna hold it down. She got them hot fire bars for the motherfucker. For the niggas and the bitches, you know what I'm saying? She's gonna do her thing regardless, man. She's gonna keep it fly, she's gonna keep it cute, and she's gonna do what she do, man. We're gonna support her all the way through it. Fucking right. Straight up. And Big H Crown yep. said that. Win win. Yeah, you already <laughs> know it. <laughs> yeah. So many C. So 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 many C tell us, bro, what inspired you to do music? Let us know, man. <laughs> Man, this is where I come from. Like, I grew up in the music field. Like, my cousin, she sings and stuff. So, shit, when we were growing up, that's all we wanted to do. Like, music. We was in a studio at 12, 13 years old. You know what I'm saying? This shit ain't just yeah. happening overnight. I've been working for some years. Yeah. So, you were singing first or you was doing rap first? I was singing first. Like, but I couldn't really sing like that. And like, I just knew how to write all the songs and I would mostly write the songs for my cousin to sing cause she could sing, sing. And mm -hmm. uh, she was the one, she was like, man, you know what, Nick? You need to be the rapper. Like try to say that, but rap it. I'm like, girl, I can't rap. She was like, just try it. So, you know, I just got hopped on that bitch. I liked it, I sound And ever since then, like shit, it was up from there. So you did your first show yet? Yeah, I did a show in um South by Southwest. That was my first show. It was see, lit as fuck. I seen like, you on the internet when you was doing that too. I seen you. You seen it? <laughs> I watching. I watch everything. Fuck it, right? Everybody was fucking with me. I signed some autographs that day and everything. Like, and that was my first time popping out. And like, you know, I was going through some shit with my kids, so I had to get them together. So I took a step back from it for a minute. But shit, I'm back in action now. Southwest, yeah, we've been Southwest. saying you're moving. Yeah. That's big. That ain't nothing little. South by Southwest, that's big. So Hell yeah. And that's, that's my first time. Fucking so right. what 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 you what you coming out? What you got going on? Did you drop anything for uh the summer for the girls? What's what's going on? Hell what, what yeah, got? I dropped it. I got a hot ass track right now called Bounce That Ass. That yeah. bitch is lit like <laughs> All the females uh, fucking with that shit. It's on YouTube. Word. YouTube, it's at like 11K views right now. And it's only been out for like a month. Yeah. So, you know, I'm yeah. trying to push through with that. And then I got another bounce mixtape that I'm working on right now called History in the Making. Because this one right here, this is going to make history. Yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm feeling it. I like how you coming, cuz. And I've been seeing you, I've been seeing you push like this year. You you've been going full throttle on the low. We've been seeing you. We've been seeing you. Even Bay been saying it. You know, that's when I decided I said, cuz going so hard. I said, Mocky, let's go on it. Let's go on and 
get many in motion. Groove watching, that's groove. how South by South Yeah, works. groove that's over there, grinding. I meant yeah, to tap yeah. in with you when I came up there to Houston, but I wasn't I thinking. I did. Damn, you should have hit me up, shit. Bay say she did, but you ain't respond. Who? Mazda. Oh, she hit you up? She hit me up? She hit, yeah, she said she, oh, she tried I to know. hit you up. I think she hit me up when I was in New York. I remember she what you're talking about. York, baby. Yeah, yeah, okay. I went to New York. She saw what my Yeah, she went. I think she in New York. Yeah, yeah, she been, she I been, she that. read it. She read the link, which she done been said that shit. Cause oh, it's only a matter of time. Cause you gotta come down here to Georgia sooner or later, and you know. Yeah, I'm making my way up there. That's my next stop. I already put yeah. that on. That's cool. <laughs> but we finna level up. We trying to level everybody up and along the way. Right. It's fucking yeah, yeah. right. <laughs> Yeah, let's go on and put this shit in motion because you know some people be be bullshitting when it comes down to the grind. You feel me? But no, nah, we 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 grinding, baby. Everybody see who got some shit in motion. You feel me? Hell yeah. Yeah. You, 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 hell yeah. All you gotta do once you once you step outside low and let other people see your talent besides your state. Watch how they watch how they grasp you. Nah, watch how they embrace you for real. I seen I see you got a couple followers from my hometown following you. That's why I say that. So they dig in your they dig in your style when it comes down to your music. Fucking right. And I got you like gotta, some different styles. That's another thing. Like, so I got people fucking with me from all over. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And That's when I be going, like when I went to Brooklyn, I didn't even know they had homies out there in Brooklyn till I pulled up and I seen how they was pushing the movement like that. Like, I love that shit, you know, because I do this yeah. shit for real. And they show yeah. love, like that shit mean a lot. Mm -hmm. That was big. And yeah. From the South to New York, you know, New York, a whole different culture, really. Yeah. That's the yeah. Mecca. Hell yeah. That's the Mecca. Looking right. Yeah, that's yeah. the headquarters. Yeah. So if they embrace you, oh, anyway. you feel me? That's love. I did a little video in Times Square. I did a remake to that Jay Z song "Cry." Is Why you was up there? Hell yeah, that bitch was hot. I did some shit with um, King Kush. We got this hot ass track in the drop soon, like any day now. It's called "Certified." We just did the video in New York. The 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 lat the song cry joints you got a video to that? Yeah, I ain't post, I ain't dropped it yet, but I'm gonna drop it. It's already done. I'm just waiting okay. on the day to drop it. I got one I'm, question. How long you been holding on to this one? Shit, I just got it. I just finished it like two weeks ago. <laughs> oh, okay, I was about to say if she say anything got to do with months, she tripping. Hell no, I'm about to drop. I'm about to get them that hot shit. You know what I'm saying. I gotta subscribe to you, cuz. Yeah, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Yeah, I'm gonna do that right now. With two E's. M I N N I E C E E. Who else Oh, you said with two E's? You How you said you spelled many? Yes, with two E's. No, she, I, I think she said C with two E's. Yeah, C M I N N I E. Space mm -hmm. C E E. I got you. I got you. Y'all yeah, gonna see my picture up there. I think I got on yellow. Yeah, I see. I got you, low. Yeah, you do. Yeah, 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 I got you. So I can so I can be updated on everything. And everybody <laughs> else, make sure they subscribe too, man. Get her. Yeah, y'all go follow me to see. Stop playing. Y'all trip. Yeah, follow Instagram me. Up too, man. I got that Tell hash them. man. I got some new shit dropping. Me and H Crown got one too. Me and um Big H Crown, we gotta um hit them up coming up too. We need all that information. Tell them where they can find you, Big Groove, on Instagram, all the platforms that you got while you while you locked up, Loco. Yeah, my um Instagram is H Crown 52. Um, Instagram is H Crown. Uh, my Twitter is H Crown, and um, 
Y'all got a mixtape by Orange Season. That's on Death Kiss and uh, my mixtape. Orange Season? Mm -hmm. Yeah, Orange Season. And uh, yeah, got some hot shit coming up. Like I said, many, many, many shit. We got a hot track called Hit Em Up on some Tupac remix type shit on some West Coast, West Coast, uh, West type shit. You know what I'm saying? So we got that coming. Yeah, I'm already knowing you. You gotta, you gotta take with my G homie, um, rag number two, J Real. You heard him. My I had to say it again, cause you heard him. I, I said, I said you gotta, I said you gotta, uh, uh a mixtape with my G homie, uh, rag number two. You gotta take I said, I said, I said you gotta two. take with my G home and Blue Rag number two. J Real right. the Realist. Yeah. Yeah, that 6200 track. Yeah, me and Taz did that a couple years back. I keep it 50. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm already knowing what's yeah. going on, though. That shit was hard. Cuz working like a CEO from, from, from the thing thing, you feel me? Hell yeah. yeah. We yeah, waiting yeah. on you to come home. I know you don't wrote. I know you don't wrote some shit while you've been in there, loco. Remaining. Yeah, hell yeah. They locked me down, man. But I want to try to hold it down. Man, you see, I love you, bro. You do your thing. You know your thing, and uh, you have a good interview, man. And uh, it was good talking to y'all, bro. You already know it. Big ages, loco, man. Yeah, big ages. I have a good one. All man, right. Business. Crown business, verse. Verse. <laughs> Man. Yeah, man. That was what's up, man. That was, oh, clown <laughs> call. Yeah, that was hard. Man. <laughs> he called it the yeah. right call. Yeah, that was dope as hell. Straight up. That's, that, that's some <laughs> good. That free energy cuz. of motherfucker. Hey, man. Straight like that. Yeah, yeah. free cuz, man. Free to loaf, man. Free to loaf. Yeah. Oh, nah, for real. <laughs> Uh, so, so how many how many tapes you done dropped in all cause since you've been doing your independent thing? Let these folks know, man. Um, well, right now I only got two actual projects, one EP and one mixtape. But yeah. I have two more right now that's in the making that I'm doing at the same time. I got a mixtape and an EP coming. You got anything in the store? Like iTunes, any of that? Oh um, yeah, I got some stuff on iTunes. I got a song with Lil H Crown, King Guap, and um yeah. he called Real Oaks. I don't know if y'all heard that or not. I heard that. That shit hard. I'm looking, I heard it. I'm looking <laughs> right now. I got I, that. I, 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 oh shit. I seen with, I seen when that was being shared. Yeah, that hoe was going. That hoe was hot. I'm not gonna lie, that hoe was going up. Um, we did another one in El Paso, too, with the homie um, Day One Cap. I don't know him, but that's one of our homies, and he's from El Paso, and we did a track with him. That shit hard as fuck, and I got a lot of shit. I'm going to post some links when we get off of here and shit, so y'all can follow, subscribe, and, you know, we can exchange information and stuff. Yeah, we, we, send, us, send us like a little trailer or something, man. When the video yeah, because we gonna make snippets and everything, loco, and like all your shit, all your shit. Let me see, let me see if I can play y'all a little something. I just did this one called No By Me. Y'all heard the 716 mixtape? No, no. No, I heard people saying that there was it was gonna be one in the making, but I didn't know that it was the one actually dropped. Oh, got a link to that too. Yeah, I'm gonna drop the link to that. I'm um I'm about to play my song that was on the mixtape on the 716 mixtape. It's called No About Me. Oh yeah, we 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 who where is it on iTunes? Was it on YouTube or something? Yeah. Ain't nobody... it's Y'all can hear it? Yeah, we can hear it. Yeah, we we can hear it. Yeah, this is my last video I did. <laughs> Bitch, what you know about me? 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 Bitch, what you know about me?
bitch, you know about me. Little bitch, you don't know who. This fuck what you heard. Don't come run up the seat. Ran down on that bitch like I was Cardi B. But it was more than twice. Bitch, I'm no good now, too. Every day I'm trying to show shit. Got the troll, I'm dead for troll, bitch. How you speak on my name, they don't know shit. Tell the cops, yeah, I get it over with. How the fuck you talking about? First, I thought you was a little shy, but I, I, I seen like I think when you was in a, I, th- I seen you kick a freestyle while you was in the car, in the door. Oh, that I was, was a throwback. That was yeah, my first that rapping on Instagram. I swear to God, like where that was. That's where it all started. That's but but I- you wasn't afraid though. You you weren't you weren't in your shell. Like you feel me? Hell yeah. That- <laughs> Fire on Facebook. It had got like 12k views on Facebook. Like you were popping it, cuz. Yeah, that you were popping it. And that was my first one. <laughs> hey. So you think you ready to go state to state doing shows and promoting what you're doing? You think you ready? I'm trying to get all my shit together. I just got my little lash wood, you know, my shit going on. Y'all see that? I got the mini eyes. Oh, that's hard. Going on. I got the lash play. You feel me? This one, the package. Yeah. The lip gloss and the serum, the lashes. All that. You know all that good shit. And this is hey, real music. She ain't just rapping. She she doing business. Yeah, she got some shit business. going on. Cause <laughs> let them know where they can where they got where, where they where they can find you for that. Yeah. Yeah, y'all can hit me up on any of my social media. I also ship, deliver, whatever you need. I'm going to make it happen. You know what I'm saying? Um, my Instagram is mini, M-I-N-N-I-E underscore C-E-E with three E's. And then my Snapchat is mini, C-E-E with three E's, five, two. And my Facebook is just mini C-E-E with two E's. Y'all can hit me up on any one of those. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, y'all need to go follow her straight up. ASAP. Yes, follow ASAP. She the next thing to blow out of Ace Town. Yeah. Fucking right. A bitch is really up next. Y'all just watch <coughs> watch me. <coughs> Pay she close coming. Attention. She coming. Most of these girls ain't talking about name. Many, many goddamn. Man, if gonna come put a put 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 that shit on Paul. I might have to send you some my damn self. Straight yes, up. Shit. Yeah, because do we think too many? Whoever's trying to work right now, I'm on go. Whoever's trying to work, I'm accepting applications. I'm, you know what I'm saying? I'm doing this, I'm making shit happen. That's how yeah, it's cool, man. You gotta get to Hell yeah, yeah. We're gonna help yeah, you. You got that. Here. You got that Ace Town flow too. 
It don't sound like Megan or no shit like that. No, it don't sound like that. I ain't trying to put you in that category. You better than her. Huh. Trying to be uh, that. Oh. <laughs> hey, she just she she just got a machine behind her loco. That's all. Yeah, but that's a good thing. Right, that's a good thing. Ain't no bad thing. It's just your time come, everybody get their time. Hell yeah. Everybody, everybody get their time. Exactly what you said, but I'm gonna emphasize that a little bit because it's our time, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, straight up. That's what this shit is for. Like, we gotta kick the door down. Ain't no op- getting the door open because no. open the shit up for us due to the politics we always discuss. So nigga, niggas gotta do that shit on their own, man. And we gonna kick the door down. We ain't knocking on shit. So, no, we ain't asking. We ain't asking, we taking it. So everybody yeah, man, we, the same, nigga. That's what the fuck yeah. the platform is for, man. Come up here and showcase that shit. Put it on the map. You gotta stand on it. You gotta stamp it. And make mm-hmm. sure that's what you leaning on. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna make sure we push it just like you push it. So so tell us how how is the how is the uh how is the how is the uh how is the music scene uh down there in Houston right now at the moment? Um, right now it's a lot of it's a lot of people doing some shit, you know, but Houston is not like how Atlanta is. If Houston yeah. was like how it is out there where everybody support each other and right, you know, right. It used we, to be like that. Huh? Let it me, used to be. Nah, it's not though. Shit then changed. Like Man. everybody beefing and everybody. You know what I'm saying? This person feel like they bigger than this person. They don't want to work with this person because this person feel like they already up here. But really, we all on the same level. We all trying to make it. You know what I'm saying? This is this what, what we tell most Houstonians. You know, like we don't get in the North and the, in the South yeah. politics. You know, that little beef thing that going on. We love y'all music as a whole, dog. Straight mm-hmm. up. You feel me? We don't go with Oh, oh, he from the north. I ain't listening for him. Oh, he from the south. Nigga, that shit hard. Bad. That shit, that shit hard. We grew up off, we grew up off H Town music down here in G A. You feel me? That shit, that oh, shit would never fire. stop. Like we could, yeah. If we wasn't listening to screw, that was like the uh, the other half of what you got to be doing to drink lean. Like you got to have some screw on, like. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we follow the culture. We listen to it if we ain't drinking, because it don't seem like we really a hundred percent doing what we supposed to be doing while we listening to this shit. Yeah, so it's a culture. But when I say what it, they used to have it because at one time you used to ran rap. Hell, like that's what I'm talking about. Like Atlanta got it now, but it was a time where you used to have it before that. So yeah. that's why I say they used to do that. I don't know what happened. Maybe it's the beast with everybody that she, Yeah, that's what she said. Everybody, one person think they're bigger than the other person, but it's enough money. That that city so goddamn big. You still ain't seen no magazine cover with 20, 30 Houston niggas on it that was eating at the time. It's been a minute. You still ain't seen that. You seen that. Yeah. So they had the whole source cover. Like Everybody that was eating in Houston was on the source. Not a East Coast mm-hmm. nigga, not a West Coast nigga, not a mid. If you wasn't from Houston, yeah, they had you wasn't it, on yeah. that cover. They was back when they had that cover when it said uh Houston, we have a problem with J Prince, Pimp, Zero, everybody. Zero had the blue, blue best on and the blue yeah. Like, yeah, when they, Pimp got out. This shit. They was running shit. So I don't and, know how they end up from that to where they at now. Cause the music's still there, but the, the I, I see what I think, man. Niggas gotta stop looking at each other crazy and just do music. That don't mean you gotta click up and be with the niggas or whatever. Just do, make the music for the culture. Mm-hmm. Just do it for the fans. Fuck what he don't like you. He don't like you. Listen, the fans want to hear Zero and Trey on the same track again before these niggas pass. Hell yeah, that's what I'm you saying. You see what I'm saying? That's Stop right. being, come on, man. Somebody got to be the bigger person, dog. Y'all niggas ain't killed each other. Ain't no blood shit. Do that shit for the fans. If y'all love y'all fans, it shouldn't be about the money. Thanks. 
Yeah, like that's what you Pimp know, was trying to say. Like niggas you know, need need to come that, together. You know, you don't think that the you know when Tip came to Houston and that shit happened with him and Flip, and then they allegedly cause swung on Tip. Mm -hmm. you oh yeah, me? nigga. He but that's not a nigga in the wrong nigga. A nigga come to my city and he he get wrong. With somebody from my city, you gotta take up from the nigga. You gotta take up for the nigga from your city. So he technically did what he was supposed to do, but I'm saying that I don't know what him and Trey went through. But then you see your people go over there with the nigga. You know, sitting in the street be deep, man. So you know what I'm saying? Yeah, it do with the politics. Sit like politics in some type of way. I mean, but it's like at some point. If you know your fan, if you love your fans, you gotta you gotta do what's right for your fans because they the ones spending money with you. Fucking right. Yeah, right. It, 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 you right. can't worry about right. another right. nigga feelings. It's two sides to this shit. You got niggas that's doing music that ain't street niggas, so they don't live by the same politics and the morals of the shit. Then you got niggas that street niggas. So when they go through street shit with certain niggas that they shouldn't have went through the shit with in the first place, that make it. If your cousin cross you and an op cross you, you gonna have a problem with your cousin more than you gonna have a problem with your op because this nigga should have never crossed you. This my cousin. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So when you see this nigga go over there and he doing this thing over there, you like nigga, how you how you how you go side with the nigga that? And I'm your blood. Yeah, that's, that's, that's shit, right? and rap because we got to deal with that some kind of way. Man. And it get My deeper man. over time. Like the more you let that shit keep going, it get deeper. And, and, but still, because at some point you got to think about. Long jeopardy. Both of them niggas. That's left. why. That's why. That's why a lot of niggas can't get ahead because they they still they they still be stuck in their shell. I'm gonna tell like, you. You gotta. It's you not, gotta say fuck it. It's not really mended though because both of these niggas successful. Neither one of them. Yeah, they need, are. Neither one of them niggas need the other nigga to make they they success with. They them. don't. So they that don't. makes it harder to mend because. Ain't nobody on either side in need, so I don't need to reach out to you, nigga. So it's a pride. And nigga, we men, men got a pride issue, nigga, so we don't like to do certain shit. I ain't about to reach out to this nigga. That's how niggas be feeling, cuz. Hell yeah. <laughs> so you know what I'm saying? Yeah. They don't know what another but, but nigga don't, But don't get mad when you be getting cussed out in the comments. <laughs> but, don't get mad. Yeah, the comments are gonna stop with who buying and coming to the show though. Cause guess what? Believe it or not, them niggas, believe it or not, them niggas read them comments when them fans have something to say. That's your bread. You better the second thing is it don't stop their bank account though. So no, it don't, it doesn't. It doesn't, it doesn't. It doesn't matter. When zero come out, niggas crowd still the same. When Trey come out, his crowd still the same. True. Like I, you know what I'm saying? They got to want to fix that shit. Can't nobody make them niggas fix that shit. If, if, the, if they did it, boy, I could see Ace Town, everybody from Ace Town on the on the, on the the uh, stage together. But what them niggas going through don't dictate what Ace Town do, though. It, it, uh, but oh, it don't, but, but guess what? But it's the power, it's the power the, that both of them have on the city. Yeah, but 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 what she, she in the new generation? Yeah, she is the new generation. Straight she up. Nigga. She do. She ain't many. She no. for the new generation. Is is it a lot of female rappers down there where you at, Loco? Hell yeah. It's it's a lot. Like everybody wanna rap. Like everybody's rapping or wanna rap now. Like no cap. But it can they rap though? Yeah, it's some hot, it's some hot females out there and shit yeah. like that. Boys, you know what I'm saying? It's a lot of people. Yeah. But you, you in a different bracket though, because in the rap game, <coughs> you know, a bunch of females. 
<laughs> ain't got too many people you got to worry about like that. It's only a handful. Mm-hmm. You see what I'm saying? All you gotta do is come out, pop your shit, and stand on that shit and and stamp it, and that shit gonna do what it is. Oh, fucking right. A hundred thousand female rappers. It's hard as hell for a female rapper. You got to know how to rap, and you got to have the swag. You got to have all of that, and a lot of people got all that. So to be able to rap and have a swag, it puts you in a different situation. You can do whatever. You just gotta stand on it. That's it. Real. Ain't nobody coming out of Houston making no noise on the female side right now except Megan Thee Stallion. You got a lot of music you sitting on. You got to quit sitting on it and drop that shit. Mm-hmm. Uh, that's what I'm on right now. Like, I'm trying to get my shit together because, you know, I do this shit by myself. Like, I ain't really got no team behind me. You know what I'm saying? I'm real independent. Like, I do everything by myself. Or whatever, you know, I just started getting like, you know, I got Chim Chim helping me out. I, I got baby Sam trying to help me. Like, you know, I got some people in my corner now, but at the time when I first started rapping and shit, I really just hopped in the field. No doubt. But sometimes we all did, cuz though. But sometimes your best help gonna come from another state. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Because you seen, you seen, I ain't waste no time because I ain't even never heard, never, never chopped it up with you on the phone or nothing. But I already know. I said, it's my loach. You over there grinding. It's a must. You feel me? I got to. I got to. She pressed us too. She said, since you're all ready and shit, when we doing this shit? Since we are ready. Yeah. 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 Yeah, she speeded up the process, so you know we had to go on and take off. <laughs> Fucking right, because I said, man, yeah. I'm Put the press on. Inside, it's your... inside work, work. I'm gonna decorate your room. I'm gonna decorate. Yeah. This, this your first. Yeah. This your first interview. Um, no, this is like my this is my second one. Yeah. And this, uh, you gonna you gonna give us a second one too, <laughs> and a third one. Right. And the third one, we're going to keep going. The, the grind don't stop. We're going to keep going. The platform, man, we support all young business entrepreneurs and rappers and models and actors. And we the yeah, industry. we supporting the culture. But we going to definitely always make so, man, we push for niggas that's the family. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. We're going to do that for the family. Man, you know what you I'm know? Oh. Cause that's important. Sure. Black ball from a lot of shit. So you know what I'm saying. Fuck that. We ain't gotta bring. We gotta bring, we gotta bring the family through. Our own shit. And can't nobody tell us what to do. This our shit. So nigga, yeah, we gonna open the door. We gonna make sure everybody get in too. Fucking Look, right. Stand on. Yeah. It's only right. That's what you know. What I'm saying that's what we here for. Like we in the same entourage. So we need to be. You know what I'm saying. Everybody. Helping each other, pushing this, pushing that, and we lose. And everybody that's watching this and go and watch it or listen to it when it drops Monday. I mean, it's streaming live so people on social media can see it, but it, it come out in stores and on YouTube Monday. So everybody heard what she said. Understand Ooh. that, because that shit important, man. Fucking right. Yeah. That shit real important. Because I'm saying, ever since I've been, you know what I'm saying, making moves with you know, linking up state to state, different people, different homies and shit. Like everything been working more for me than when I was just in my city, just trying to do it. Cause I noticed what that if- outside your city, they gonna fuck with you more because the people from your city, they can't accept that y'all from the same section, but you doing all this, you know what I'm saying? You turn into competition. Yeah, they yeah. try to- yeah be like that like I, I just don't understand uh, good that because I ain't never even been like that like I support everybody I waited my turn literally like before I was up I've been rapping you know what I'm saying I was rap, probably rapping for everybody I know that's rapping now yeah. but I knew my time was gonna come so I sat and I played my position you know what I'm saying uh, yeah, I, I, support- seen, I seen you I was watching I might not have never said nothing nothing like that but I be watching people when they do their thing because you can't tell if they're serious about what they do unless you watch them. 
Mm-hmm. I seen you at the South by Southwest perform, and then I seen you do the video where you was like rapping and like singing on the hook or something. Like oh, yeah. I seen that. I seen all that. You That's know, I be watching. Yeah, I got a lot of videos like that I'm working on with um, um, Square Business Media. That's who be filming my videos out here. He one of the homies too. Like he he got some good quality. You know what I'm saying? So. Well, I think, I'm uh, on the show one day, man. Square business. Yeah, square business medium. Yeah, we gotta, we gotta follow home. We gotta follow cuz. Hell yeah, cause he he a good factor. Like he got good quality videos. He's doing a movie right now too and shit. That's who I really get to shoot most of my videos. If not, um, Fortune Five Hundred Films out here in Victoria, Texas. He's another good one. He shot my bounce that ass video, the last one I just did. Mm. But that's like the only two people that I've been let fuck with my videos right now. Yeah, I just found Cuz. Yeah, that shit. Shout out to Cuz. Shit. Now, when you but, do your music, is it anybody that that's in the game right now <coughs> that you would work with if they can? Right, gang. Yeah. Shit, y'all already know I want to work with Megan. I want to work with Cardi. I'm trying to work with Trina. I'm trying to work with Asian. Because she remind me of a young Trina, though. Everybody say that. That's crazy. I don't know. They don't look nothing alike. No, none of that. The swag is different and all that. But what? <laughs> vibes. She giving nigga Trina vibes. <laughs> yeah, true. And then we both Sagittarius too. Like <laughs> that's probably what it is. That's that Sagittarius shit. <laughs> Nikki, I'm trying to work with Nikki too. That'll be dream come true. That though she said that because she ain't being discriminated between nobody that's on the lower bracket or at the top. Like whoever at her favorite is like that's who she want to work with. Like, mm-hmm. you know, most females be like, I ain't fucking with her, so I, I would fuck with her. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Mm-hmm. That's a good way to think because you saying I fuck with Cardi, I fuck with Nikki, I fuck with Meg, I fuck. And we need we need more females. They will only fuck with you just because you 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 showing them early that like I would fuck with them. Hell yeah. I'm I'm all for it. I'm all for women empowerment. Like, I'm real big on it. Because, like, you know what I'm saying? I don't have no sisters. I don't have no blood sisters. So it's like, me, when it comes to other women trying to win, I'm real big on it because I didn't have that. I always did this shit by myself. You know what I'm saying? I knew you was lacking female support when you named all, all the homies that were supporting you. But you didn't name off not one female. Bad. Bad. That love gonna come from out of town, cuz. Yeah. Hell yeah. Watch. I'm <laughs> telling you what God love. It always happened like that. That's why it's all about leaving home and networking and rubbing shoulders with other people. It's weird, but everybody in your city follow last. Mm-hmm. That that shit is weird, but that's how it be. Because the people that's watching you turn into what you turn into look at you like you still the person they had went to school with, or you still the person I'm just smoking blunts with. When really you ain't even right. something else for real. You know what I'm saying? And in other states, they embrace you like what they see. Oh, she doing music, she doing this, and she doing that. They embrace you for that, not what you was in the hood doing or what you. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? They're embracing what they see you doing. And it's mm-hmm. different. You know what I'm saying? Because they didn't hey. go with you. So they seeing, they taking in what you doing, what they see you doing. It's a little different. That's why I always tell people, man, focus on the strangers. Fuck your friends because they going to be the last to like yeah. all that shit. Man, people that don't know you will treat you like a superstar just because your video look like the last rapper video. You know what I'm saying? It's kind of, it's the quality the same. So you know what I'm saying? They're going to treat you like, damn, she famous. Yeah. Uh, you ain't even famous, but that's how they look at you. Where the people at, where you at. And you got to present like, yourself that, that way also. Yeah, you do. You do. 
It's Hell. important. So that. It's important, especially when you're independent, because if you sit there and just act like, you know, just get that dry <laughs> energy, like, shit, I'm, I'm such and such, but they don't look at you like, oh, he ain't nobody. But if you let them know, hey, listen, I'm such and such, I'm such and such, I'm here, you know what I mean? They be like, oh, shit, this motherfucking energy, like, hey, you <laughs> feel me? Right. Yeah. <laughs> all, that, all that being humble and all that, man. If you got you got your your shit in black and white, and, and, and you got all your your paperwork looking right, you better run your mouth. Yeah, yeah. Time yeah. To yeah. The, 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 the same way if you were punching the clock for them people. Hey, that's how you need to be representing yourself when they come down to being an entrepreneur or whatever you trying to be. Straight up. Yeah, yeah. And she got a brain. You know, I, I'm a rap nigga, but I watch a lot of rap niggas and I manage rappers. So it's like, you when I'm looking at people do what they do, I'm really watching. Like, okay, you mm -hmm. I'm about to do that. It's the same thing with me and Cuz. Like, Cuz started doing what he was doing. Once I seen him really doing what he was doing, I'm like, shit, Cuz, you know what I'm saying? Shit, you know what I'm saying? I'm a, See, if you, you do this, it's going to make shit easier. You do that, it's, and, and over time, that just turned us into something else. You know what I'm saying? Just showing a nigga another. When you show somebody else how to win, you win too. You don't have to you don't have to win all the time and then look at a nigga like, nigga, I won. Showing another nigga how to win is you winning too. Mm-hmm. That's so right. They don't do that. They don't do that. No, they don't. They so don't. And, and that's and that's why that's why people don't people don't be growing. That's why other people, if you notice, majority of the people that be from your hometown, when they when they take off, they take off because they leave from where they was from and get away from the hate and what mama got to say, daddy got to say, cousin got to say, homeboy, and they go do what they got to do. Yeah. You feel me? Because I, I, you, you know, once you, you leave your city, you leave. know you can't be you can't be content, you can't be comfortable. You know you got to handle business, or you you gonna be taking your ass back home. It's mm -hmm. go hard or go home. And then you Hell. get mad because they feel like they was right the whole time. You gotta yeah. see that you really right. You know what I mean? So it's a, you gotta overcome the doubt. Period. Mm hmm. Fuck your right. Yeah, yeah. Kind of work sometimes because starting off is a, it's a process builder, and it is. Yeah, yeah. but oh, oh, you it's gonna be some days you going you gonna shed some tears. You gonna want to hit. You might want to shoot. You know what <laughs> I mean? That's what come with all. That's what that's what builds the character. Like I was saying, you feel me? That's what's gonna all that crying and ready to give up and all that shit. That's what's gonna turn you into a monster. You feel me? They say if you do whatever you do, they say if you whatever you if you get whatever you do ten thousand hours, you should be an expert. Hell yeah. But I always tell people on my team, like I'm giving y'all a shortcut because I've been in this shit for some decades, so I know the game. So the shit that you gonna have to bump your head on if you just listen. You ain't gonna have to bump your head with this shit because I'm telling you what you really gotta do. Don't chase what you see on TV. I'm telling you what you really gotta do. Like, you yeah. don't gotta get rich in this shit to uh, go sign no deal. Now you signing your whole life over. You can go, shit, to an independent artist making $10,000 a month. That's successful. Man. Shit. I love, I love to be independent. I don't want nobody to be over my head and watching what I got going on. <laughs> you gonna get that yeah. regardless when you start progressing, because even I mean, uh, but but you you know what I'm saying though, because oh, you know what I'm, well, you know what I mean. I ain't with all that. I ain't. Bex, thinking you know, they they did this, nigga ain't did shit. No, I ain't trying to. All I'm trying to do is keep investing the next. Like every six months, I'm trying to invest in something else, invest in something else. I'm not trying to be complacent at nothing. I'm trying to keep going. You've been doing that though. Yeah, you right. I have. 
She in seven months. I, yeah, cut off the grind too. Doing lashes and all the other extra. I just was seeing. Yeah, it. she came. She she came out the blue with the lashes. What yeah, that other cat was coming? Some other some shit. Lash yeah. Yeah. Some lash wood. Yeah. Some lash wood grew line. Yeah. Mini hard. Eyes. She pulled them that's out. Hard. Oh, she's about to pull out a pack of backwoods with her nails. Yeah, that's oh. hard. <laughs> you <laughs> killed them with that. You yeah. killed them with that, girl. I'm fucking with that. In that last party. party tasking, that's that's entrepreneurial type. Yeah, she ain't just rapping. She kicking that. She kicking this. She kicking that. She got a lot of shit. Going. And I got that's another thing because wow. I be seeing niggas in the streets and niggas be asking me how they gonna get on the show or, or you got to have something really going on. And if you don't really got something going on, you really got to sit down and talk to it because yeah. It's people that really got something going on and we provide the avenue for them to be able to showcase and put what they got going on out there to the world because we all got different sets of followers. Mm -hmm. so, mm -hmm. This is the platform for that. And yeah. come on, this right. if you ain't got nothing yeah. going on, what we supposed to talk to you about? Because we gonna be done talking in about five minutes. <laughs> I mean, we on we on ten digital platforms. You feel me? And people download. Oh, no, 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 no. He got that all kind of fucked up. This I'm, is just like how music. Wait, hold on. We on a lot of platforms. Oh, take, hold on, where is it? Hold on, where is it? You can go any goddamn where and find us. Hold yeah, on. Yeah, it's a little bit different, nigga. Hold on. Spotify, Amazon Music, Podcast Addict, Pod Chaser. Pocket Cash, Listen Notes, Player FM, Podcast, and Pandora, iHeartRadio, Goddamn Xbox. We I'm all over the. What you talking about, man? If you got, we all over the. We all over the place, like dog shit. Yeah. Yeah. Shit, I'm in Atlanta, <laughs> August thirteenth on Dirty Glove Bastard. So we we. We really leveling up in y'all faces because we two seasons in. Her mm -hmm. each episode marks the the tenth episode of season two, so season two is wrapped up. When y'all saying we right. before, and this is season three, like we ended the last season with many seasons. And this this real life real life standing on what you trying to brand because when we started this shit, we ain't had no backdrop. You can see that nigga dining room. He was eating and shit. You can see Man. my washer and dryer and shit in the back. <laughs> like, hey, shit was real. Like was in all this shit was out the mud. Real talk. Yeah. My right. camera was smaller than his camera type shit. Yeah. Like we really did this shit out the mud. All yeah. grind. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah, so yeah, yeah. Crazy. <laughs> And I that shit it. groovy as fuck too. Y'all got y'all pictures in that. They a lot. Yeah, yeah, man. You know for we the, had the for the, the culture, culture for the street. Hell yeah. <laughs> yeah. I like it. for the culture. You know, it, that's that's church. why we that's why we be letting them know like this platform just ain't uh for rappers, it it for entrepreneurs, fashion designers, like. Man, whatever gift yeah. you got, and you got it. Got something going on, and we don't know that's like uh, something that you could do. You can come on this show and showcase that, like, right? oh, yeah, oh, hell yeah, present oh. that shit just like how you did. That was hard because I didn't see that coming. I thought you were just gonna give us straight hip hop, though. <laughs> hell yeah, you know I gotta. Oh, do I didn't think she was gonna do that. Nah, I know. I wanna. I want to present one more thing. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah, yeah, come on with it. Let, let, let hold the people on. know. We in action. Hold on. Let's we... go. Hold on. Hey, you know what? I still need my mask, man. I told you. <laughs> Hit me up. I, I got still you. need my shit, man. I got the for the blood, niggas. You feel me? I got the pink for the hot bitches. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's I hard. I still need my shit, man. Let me know. I need my shit still. I don't want to fuck my hair up. <laughs> Y'all get the picture, though. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's hard. 
Yeah, I got your back. All that shit when you got to wear the mask, the party, you got to have a party, you got to wear the mask. A masquerade or some more. Well, you got you got to wear a mask. Period. That's hard. Though. That'd be hard. Have a whole masquerade with the with the joints like that. This the yeah, video. That's hard. When the niggas be having in their videos and shit. Uh huh. When they had well, a gun, can't show your face. You 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 got you got those on your Instagram too. Hell yeah, I got the mini gloss yeah, right there Facebook too. Yeah. yeah, I got it on Facebook. I got all that. I got all this shit, man. Like, I don't be bullshitting. I be... Man, oh, go. tap in with Mini C, though. For Big real. One. Big tap in. Yeah. Tap in. Like ASAP. Stop playing. But it's lip gloss. She yeah, got I some hot... And be respectful because... You gonna Please. be fucked up. I'm just trying to tell you something. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just it trying to help y'all. Yeah. There's a lot of disrespectful people on social media. Do that shit with somebody else, please. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, conduct yourself, please. Please. Yeah, she gonna give you good customer service, dog. <laughs> and you know, this shit is being seen and heard by a lot of people. Nigga, you might be noticed by people you don't even realize notice when you fuck around and get doping for the disrespect. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So be respectful. But 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 other but other than other than that, she got some she got some she got some some sauce for the female. Y'all need yeah. to tap in with the low. Sure, man. Yeah. And I feel like that's what females need to do because it's a lot of females that segregate it because who don't fuck with who and females are very mm-hmm. territorial in a point to they more territorial than niggas, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, but- the, the energy you know, gotta got change. Perfect, the so. energy gotta change because Ooh. I mean it's it's I mean every every city is different, but like I said, like down here in Atlanta, when it come down to the black excellence of black people, well, rich people helping black people that got their own businesses, it's serious business. Don't let Tyler Perry or one of one of them mess around and see you. You, you just got to be at the right place at the right time, still doing your thing. Hell yeah. Yeah. You just got to keep going, like, for real, for real. There's some people watching. Hell people, yeah. People watching your Instagram, they're watching your stories every day. You don't know who land, like, I'm finna, I'm just going to jump down the mini inbox. She, she grinding like a motherfucker. I'm ready to pay her to do some work or I wanna, you, you feel me? Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. People, people see what's going on. They support when they, at, at first, well, like like he said, nobody was paying me and him no attention when it came to us doing this podcast thing. Nobody hit the like button. No nothing. It was dry. It <laughs> took a little minute. We started getting a little niggas minute. that was in movies on the show and niggas yeah. this on the show and niggas that's with these niggas on the show. Now niggas like, damn, how y'all do that? And we like, mm-hmm. just tapping in. We, <coughs> we started shaking the tables and, and that's when that's when niggas start paying attention when the drinks start falling off the table. You feel me low? Yeah. Hell yeah. Yeah. But for the most part, yeah, we 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 glad we got you on the show, cause, cause we just had to we had to let the you know. Yeah, Man, I'm need you on. on here like this shit. This shit was a blessing. You know what I'm saying? It was kind of meant yeah. to be because you know it happened in 24 hours. Within <laughs> real right? talk, real talk. Then she yeah, us that we, like, yeah, we gotta do this. <laughs> Yeah, he made us first time we did two shows in one day, and not just two shows, but we did two shows where we interviewed two females at the same. You know what I'm saying? So this mm. was really big because we don't interview a lot of females. Hell yeah, we making history. Yeah, super history. Yeah, you know? I'll guess yeah. this was a this was female day. We not two females out today. Yeah. <laughs> two two black queens. Two black queens. Hell yeah. Straight up. 
and both of them black queen I know that y'all need to tend to and follow and follow because it's a lot of female that ain't that can only guide you to only fans yeah it's people right. that doing other shit you know what I'm saying right Fair. learn from them because them the ones right. that have longevity shit Facebook and Instagram trying to shut only fans down right now so y'all better really be saving y'all money and shit yeah like you gotta you gotta have a skill you gotta have some yeah. type of drive some type of hustle man we all yeah. get old man so we all change as we get old so you know what i'm saying don't depend on shit like that when you can depend on your skill your true mm -hmm. skill, and your family and your kids can live off them skills that you provided you know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's what this shit really about yeah, yeah, get you a goddamn business and stand on that shit. Yeah. The same way you stand on your game, you stand on your business the same way. Everybody come on this show, um, lead it by example because they got stuff going on. That's all they got to look at when they watch these episodes and they listen to them on their way to work, whatever they doing. Be because everybody getting, everybody is getting to a point where they tired of working for somebody. They want to be somebody. They want to be successful, dog. And that's what this platform about for them hungry ass people. Because we are them. You feel me? We them same people that's trying to make it up out of this shit. Don't want to never punch a clock again. Yeah, I don't. Hell yeah, no. Well, yeah. Nah, I rather I rather die before I walk back up in the uh, series, <laughs> and you know that South by Southwest that was like a year or two ago, wasn't it? Yeah, that was. You know what I'm saying like I've seen that a year or two ago, nigga. I've been that, for that, a little time. I ain't even went to South by Southwest yet. <laughs> so I could see the seriousness just in that. Like, yeah, you gotta be serious to do that. And that ain't even in Houston. That's in like, where is that at? Austin. Austin, Texas. Okay. And how far? Houston. I'm. I'm. I'm gonna tell you. I'm gonna tell you what make it. What 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 gives me the drive the most when I see how the young niggas came in the game, and they didn't call no hype Williams and all that shit. They said, "Nigga, you go. You go get the camera. I'm gonna go buy this." You gonna do the video editing, like nigga. We gonna learn to do this shit ourselves. We not paying all these high ass motherfuckers. Them niggas shit. damn near out of business. Only niggas yeah. that are driving now is niggas like Hype Williams and them, cause they can make you a movie. Other than that, yeah. Yeah, niggas at the crib making that shit. They yeah. Sad. Other than that, these young niggas is at home buying the same equipment, downloading the same shit. These other people doing it, and they doing it themselves, the independent way. Hell yeah. Yeah. See, back in the days, there used to be one cameraman making all the money. He getting all of the millions, not no more. It was like that on YouTube at one time. Instead of you making all the subscribers and people coming to view your shit, you had this nigga shoot your video. He posted on his channel. And his shit, mm -hmm. 30,000 views and all these subscribers. That's his channel. Mm-hmm. True. It's just now happening where the rappers is getting the money through their YouTube, through their shit. They, okay, you're going to shoot the video, but this shit going on my channel. You know what I'm saying? Right. Hell yeah. Before that, niggas was posting that shit off their channel. I shot this shit. I'm putting it on my channel. And they was eating for a long time. So it's just yeah. all about being smart, man. Yeah. So so you you had young niggas like Soldier Boy coming to game. <laughs> And master it. Okay. <laughs> oh, okay. Everybody be mad at him, but hey, say what you want. That young nigga came in the game with a plan. He wasn't no fool. What be funny is the nigga say he the first to do a lot of shit. And he really right. Nah. He really he, is. He, he, he really he, right though, cuz. What he, popping on YouTube? He like, was young. What's on your boy? And still to this day, he still come out and be. He still can do that on the internet. He do what he want. But yeah. he know how to do it. Like, he could be quiet for two years and just come out and just say something. And all of a sudden, an uh, uproar. And then when that uproar start, he drops some songs. And then them songs be good songs. Like, she make it clap and shit. That nigga been saying, I'm the first to do this. I'm the, nigga, that was promotional. Uh, promotional. Uh, 
press release, nigga. Hell yeah. He kept saying it, he kept saying it, then she make it clap came out and Bop came out. That nigga eating off them two songs. Hell yeah, show me. He got everybody and, watching off his And he getting money off TikTok too. Yeah, because the bitch that on TikTok to that shit. They love that nigga out. I just did a track that um featuring DJ Chose and stuff. That's on TikTok right now too. It's called That Bitch Now. With DJ DJ Chose. Okay. DJ Chose. Is that Chose over there? He on that song cause she thick. The, 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 the one on that song. Oh, if it's in TikTok, on TikTok, that's in the store then. Yeah. yeah. Shit. I'm I, just, bet you, I, I bet you my girl know it. You say what? I said I'm featured on it. It's um, it's not my song. <coughs> I'm a feature on it, but it's it's hard. We waiting to shoot that video. You got a lot of shit, man. That's yeah, cuz been working. Hell yeah. That shit gotta be heard. I just gotta get in the right places with the right people. I need to start getting on these shows. Like, that's what I'm working on now. Like, sometimes you know what I'm saying? Sometimes you ain't gotta get on no shows. Sometimes you put them bitches together yourself. Mm -hmm. Yeah, after I've seen how promoters is, and they make way more money, they make 10 times more money than the nigga they booking. Shit, nigga, I was like, shit, I ain't doing this shit no more. Put this money up and do my own shit, rent the club myself. I talk to cuz about this shit all the time. It's really easy. Yeah. Them niggas get rich using just using their own bread. You can do that yourself. You can go city to city just booking yourself the first show or pay for all the other ones. Hell yeah. That's what I need to do, right? I need to see, get into that and shit like that. See who fuck I need to talk to with that shit. Yeah, shit is really you know, you know they gonna push up once you once you get on that stage, sir. Mm-hmm. Show leads. They coming. But I'm gonna fuck it up every time. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Straight up. Stop playing. Yeah, man. <laughs> One thing, sure. two things were certain. Ten, you know, 10, 20 years ago, you had to go to New York to some kind of way to be a successful artist. You don't really got to do that no more. It's different now. You got to go to the South. Yeah, you got to come down. We, we, we the headquarters now. Yeah, so everybody got to go there. That's where yeah. everybody, that's what takes the ceiling off of everybody. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You gotta, you gotta we come gonna, to that side. For sure, that. But for the most part, we been going to wrap it up because we we enjoy every minute of this interview. We had to let everybody know what's going on with this A Town coach. Feel me? Oh, man. Can y'all hear me? Yeah. 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 Fucking right. It's been real. Thank y'all for having me on here. You know what I'm saying? This shit was this shit was live. I'm definitely gonna tune in again. I'm gonna be watching y'all yeah. for the people too. Shout out H Crown again, free cuz. Yeah, man. You know free cuz. That man. was big. And, and a lot of niggas that don't know, you might be a square, so you don't understand how big uh, you know, if you don't understand how big that was, you definitely a square. So we ain't even gonna discuss it. <laughs> Yeah, man. Shout out to Ace yeah, we're not, no. yeah, we're not, you know what I'm yeah, we're not gonna wake up the dead. We're gonna let nah, him we, sleep on we, that. Hey, man. Yeah. Right, nigga, we got a big Ace Crown tapping in straight from yeah. North Carolina out the pen. What you yeah, mean? Man. I don't know what's going on, man. That was huge. <laughs> what's going on? He didn't expect that when she got on and came in and was like, shit, I got Ace Crown on the phone. I thought I was too high. Yeah, man. <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> I thought I was too yeah. high, cuz. I'm like, hey. Hey. too much. Hey, hey. but let let them let 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 the people know where they can find you before we close it out, cuz let them know all, what all you on. 
Okay, y'all can find me everywhere. I'm on um Spotify, I'm on YouTube, I'm on I'm on all platforms, really. Y'all can add my music to y'all songs on Facebook, Instagram, all that shit. Just type in mini C, M-I-N-N-I-E-C-E-E -E -E with two E's. And y'all can follow me on Instagram at mini underscore C-E-E-E -E -E with three E's. And yeah, fuck with me. If you're a producer, you got some beats, you want to fuck with me on that, y'all can you also- send, I got your email now, so I'm, 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 I'm about to send you some shit. Yeah, send me some shit. You know, I'm ready to work. I'm ready to work. So send me what you want me to get on. You know what I'm saying? I can hop on some shit, whatever. I'm ready to work. Like, it's work, work, don't play right now. So, yeah, y'all fuck with me. Everybody make sure you check her out, man. It's time, yeah, man. Y'all do that. It's time for that culture for the street. Mafia, menace. <laughs> we out of here, man. Big H's. <laughs> Big H's All right. All right. One.